Uh, hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you a short sample of a Microsoft uh, Flow or Power Automate Flow that we can use in order to create planner using Graph API. So uh, let's get to it and see what we can do. Uh, how, how it's done here. This is how I've done it before. And um, you can reuse it. So uh, first, right? let's assume you have a team created. Then what you need to do next is you get the, the team ID, right? You add a small delay um, after the team is created. So then you work with planner APIs. You get the team channel, right? So here is an example. You um, say, use this uh, method get, then you use a specific call to uh, team's API, right? Uh, and then it uh, so basically this part gets the uh, team channel then what you do you parse JSON so you parse this uh, uh, body of the JSON that is returned to you and then after that you uh, can use the post method in JSON and uh, with this post method you also authenticate, then you do the parse JSON uh, for um, uh, some some information here at the expiration and, and token, things like that. And then actually the step to create the planner, right? So I do the same post method. There is some authorization information here. And then in the body of this request, I specify the owner that I had before, you know, in some previous steps, and I uh, create the title of this uh, planner. Then I parse the planner detail. Here you see we have all the details of this planner. And then I create a bucket, right, also using uh, graph API is post method and uh, then the bucket gets uh, created so um, uh, then you know I uh, create multiple buckets but you get an idea now right so these are the steps we can review them once again so uh, let's say you created uh, a team already and then when you create a team with a post method, uh, you want to create um, a planner, right? Or, or a specific uh, team channel here before the planner gets created. So uh, first, please make sure to add a delay, short delay. Um, so um, the actions are done in a sequence. Then we get the uh, the team channel. Uh, so here I, I get the specific channel. Uh, I parse the channel, right? There's an array. And after the channel is parsed, um, I do the post method here. Um, parse JSON again. And then uh, I make a call API call post to create a specific um, a team channel. So that's it. It's a short video. I, I hope it's been helpful to you. Uh, have a great day and stay healthy. Bye-bye.